Alright, so we're going to be playing Orwell. It's another Twitch Prime game that you can get for free for the month of January. And I have no clue about this game at all. I'm going in blind. And yeah. Thank you for ensuring the safety of the nation's people. Your registration is now complete. I have no clue what's going on. Another cam game. Very interesting art style. It's something I can also get behind. Look at that bush. It's just triangles. She's clean. She's straight edge. No, no file. I'm not doing anything here, by the way. This is all cutscene. Freedom Plaza, April 12th, 2017. Oh, she just fell down. Was this a... Okay. The clocks were striking 13. I don't think that's possible, but okay. This is military time, then, I guess. Yeah. You're online, good. Call me Symes. I will be your advisor on Orwell. Together, we will form both the first and last line of defense against terrorism. For this test phase, you are one of the first people to try out Orwell's system under real circumstances, selected from thousands of applicants across the globe. Normally, congratulations would be in order, but as you can see from that footage, there has been an incident. So let's get started. I've activated the reader tool for you. Its purpose is storing bookmarks to online websites and documents for easy access, and to highlight when there is new information to be investigated. First, I want you to be informed of the situation. Our leading newspaper, The National Beholder, will bring you up to speed. So I gotta go to the reader. These graphics, yeah, they're very nice. Headlines. Feel free to browse the National Beholder. I've activated, activated the profile. Open the unknown person file once you're done. So this also came with a um, the sequel the twitch prime game it's orwell uh i forget right off the top of my head but i'll put it in the video maybe and some text okay known person the profiler holds all known information on those we investigate the file you have opened is our main suspect the blue-haired woman from that CCTV footage shows before the assault is no stranger to the police. Take a look at the arrest record. I thought she was clean. Maybe I misread that. Right here. Bomb obliterates memorial freedom and kills three. Try filth. Try filth. Hargesian. I don't know if that's a real place, but it sounds like a cheese. Now I'll have some of that Parjesian on my pasta. Presidents aborts negotiation with opposition. Violent riots in tri-filth. Blaine encourages renewal. Read more. Interesting. So we need to check out blue hair. I'm on her profile. I'm clicking the background. Can you guys see the cursor on this? No, you actually can't. So, hmm. Can't find her contacts. I can't find the account. Date of birth, nothing really. Look at the rest record. Personality, activities, aliases. Uh, 
I don't know how to do this. Uh, log out. I'm going to do a pause here for a moment because I have no clue where her best record is background. Do I have to search it up on, on the web? Oh. Making progress. I thought that was the blue haired lady. The highlighted elements in the record are pieces of data that are able to be extracted. We call these elements data chunks or data, depending on how you pronounce it. Hovering over data chunks will reveal their relevance to the case and any connection of or information it may in assault on police officer arresting officer duncan lloyd holding facility bonton central pd july 10th 2016 suspect was arrested on site after officer franklin had been struck by an unknown object and became unresponsive the protesters at the origin of the assault were forcibly removed, where the suspect was found kneeling and weeping on the ground. When asked to lay on the ground with her hands behind her back, the suspect cooperated immediately. Drag and drop all data chunks from the police database into a profile to upload them to their servers. Okay. Drag and drop it over there. So I got her picture. Um, what else is no, a data chunk here? Is that all I needed to do? Oh, it's just upload all that. Oh, she's not on no, no. Very good. Pictures and names are crucial information for Orwell to identify a person. So Orwell is like a, uh, crime stopping Like in, what, what is it? It's I'm pretty sure like in China, they have like a facial recognition thing that a program that's running through their uh, cameras. And it's actually found people with arrest warrants in like a whole crowd uh, at concerts. Like the person has a arrest warrant out for them. They're just listening to music at a concert. And here come the popo, snatch them up right out of the concert because this facial recognition got them. Pretty sure that's legit, if I'm not mistaken. I have read 1984, Captain Ham, which Orwell, George Orwell, good connection right there. Information in documents can only become a data chunk when it is clearly assigned to a char target person add the reason for miss watergate's prior arrest that has been unlocked we just need this information to progress okay uh, it's just a, it's like a drag and drop game it's weird good with the data you extracted from the police record a new document can now be assessed now let me ask you a question do you believe in coincidence no never I do not. Find data revealing where she attacked the police officer and you'll see what I mean. Mm -mm. Oh. Gotta go back. Marks. NB. Oh. This is a lot of reading. Is this 
this woman a terrorist. Women allegedly injured a police officer two weeks ago remains in custody. Trial scheduled for August. Cassandra W. Simple protester or anti-governmental terrorist. Photo, Bonton Police Department. The case that keeps the media and the public guessing. Pictured above, who had allegedly injured a police officer severely two weeks ago is still being held in police custody. The woman is accused of having hit the victim's head with a large brick. Oof. The incident occurred during a rampage at the Freedom Plaza as part of a demonstration. Uh, got motive. It's a connection. Play Tarkov re. Hey, language buzzer, language. China halted all flights for citizens to census for the government run credit system that will all be on soon. Yeah, 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 the the, the credit system. That's some craziness, man. But who am I? The judge. As you know, Miss Watergate is still running around freely. We should find out why. We should also gather more background information on her. I want to know who we're really dealing with. We, we know her name right there. That like highlights it for you. You could just read this if you want to or just find the highlighted stuff. I don't even know. Due to chaotic nature of the scene, police have not yet been able to connect the crime to the accused. Cassandra W., who is an artist by profession, has denied the accusations completely and asked her, fa ooh, and asked her fans to show their support. A trial has been scheduled for mid-August. The case received nationwide attention when Catherine Delacroix, Secretary or Security, yeah, Secretary of Security, I just had a derp, 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 derp labeled the alleged perpetrator alongside the other rioters as anti-governmental terrorist parentheses jp <laughs> oh yes who does the street art by blowing memorials to pieces by any chance great you have found another document before we go on let's clarify your job and how it affects mine shall we you have been extracted you have extracted all the info i already knew about miss watergate starting now i'm going into this case blind. Why did you have me do it? You already had all the info, bruh. The Orwell Ethical Codex dictates that investigators like yourself are the only ones allowed access to the documents of targeted persons. Advisors like me only get to see the data provided by the investigators. We will then draw conclusions and request action primary job is to provide information you deem important. Never give away incorrect or misleading data. May hit disable on a data chunk you do not want to pass on to Orwell. However, some data chunks might be necessary to progress the case. So right off the rip, me personally, this isn't my kind of game. Uh... But it's interesting. It's definitely cool doing research. Art style is nice. I like the like triangle polygons of people. So this is her her profile portfolio harboring outstanding art. <clears throat> If Twitch doesn't ban it, is it actually a bad word? Um, I'm actually really surprised that my Autobot did not catch that. Those J9 emojis make me feel physically sick. Uh, never seen that before. It's purple lips. That's what happens when robots get sick. They blow data chunks. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Turn it off. Turn what off, Buzza? The game? Or the emotes? Oh, 
I need to figure out what's important and what is not important. The game. At least the other one was sort of cool. Yeah, the other one was really cool. This one's just beginning. I'm giving it a chance, Puzza. Colorful inhabitant of Wonderland right behind the rainbow. Glad you found me. Finally found the courage to quit my dull day job and focus on my art career. Hmm. See something you like? Well, of course you do because it's freaking awesome, isn't it? Leave a message on my Utel account, the Cassie92, and tell me which piece you'd like. I'm going to make fine art print. Well, okay, that's important. Found a chat handle. This will allow us to overhear any conversations on that account. The listener has now been unlocked. New conversations will appear whenever they're started. Oh, kitty. My beloved furball, Kikiko. Definitely the one only family I need. Should I, should I upload this? Because it's kind of like, I don't know. I just want to see what happens. So you're under the impression that our wonderful Miss Watergate is really living in Wonderland. Somehow I call that doubt. Call it tuition. I messed up. Uh, people's lives are hanging in the balance here. What if you pass me something I can not identify as wrong so easily? Jeez, dude, don't be so harsh. I was just seeing. <laughs> You've got to be more careful next time around. All right. I thought it might show like she's she's a little loose, loosey goosey in the the mind. All right, is a listener listening? So we're trying to profile people. Communications, no communications recorded. Back to the reader. forget what the man told me to do find information on Cassandra's social and occupational background find the reason why the investigation was closed okay uh, singular There like a sub no okay Maybe there's a link i missed what was her day job do we do it can't be undone oh well hmm interesting we should find out what that job was okay yeah i thought thought that would work Yep, that butte is me. I was never sure about the title, though. The businessman's forgotten daughter or victim of traditionalism in pink. What do you think? Hey, that rhymes. All right. But we need to find out who, who daddy is. Christmas present for my darling. This was actually meant to be a private piece, but oh well. I have a hard time keeping it to myself. Got to find out who the boyfriend is. They don't care about the cat. We go, oh, hey, we have a new chat. All right, let's go here. Not unknown person. Hey, you. Hey, Josie. Unknown person. Finish. I can't seem to find my credit card. I assume you took it, right? Uh, you got me, Sherlock. Ooh, the sarcasm. Thick. With two Cs. I'm in the middle of buying all of Bonston with that platinum card I lifted from your desk. Uh, she's a thief. It's a platinum card, which is more important. She stole a credit card of an unknown, unknown person. If you're able to find out who she is talking about, we could lock it for the owner. 
can't stop me now. Well, luckily for you, I don't mind you going on a splurge as long as you pick up some wine for dinner. It's her boyfriend. Wine. What does Joseph Langley, my fearless attorney and all around badass have in mind this time? Wait, she stole the credit card of her lawyer? Really? Well, they're obviously a little bit more than that. Well, we should be able to track the credit card of this Langley down and lock it for him. I don't think Done. No, really. No need to thank me, Mr. Langley. You now have a profile for the related person. It can be assessed via the profiler. Okay. Data chunks will only appear for targeted persons and can only be extracted into the relevant profiles. I mean, they're just having this conversation while I'm not even paying attention. Okay. Probably just a business call from one of his favorite clients. Actually, yes, that is exactly what's going to happen. Very serious business, Cassandra. I thought as much. Guess I better pick up a bunch of wine. You'll have to get this client of yours pretty buzzed to handle all that business. Hmm. I don't know if it's a business or not. One bottle should be fine. She's a lightweight. Uh, I'm getting some like creep vibes from from this guy. Oh whatever. I guess I shouldn't pick up some of those party pills from Big Pharma, aka my parents. Then oh, she's stealing pills too. Watergate pharma entrepreneurs. That does ring a bell. Oh come on! I was only teasing. Speaking of parents, when are you going to tell them about? us uh maybe tomorrow i gotta go now text you later xoxo session closed all right so let's make a profile for whatever lawyer lawyer face was hmm wait is that what it wanted me to do no, find the reason why the investigation against Cassandra was closed. Find out her previous job. I'm guessing she worked for her parents. Bruno Watergate. That's her daddy. That's her mama. That's her sheester. That. Wait, no, that's her. Without the blue hair. I didn't read the name. That's her. Appointed to be COO of a pharmaceutical company, probably by one of her parents. Being an artist and a junior CEO seems quite odd. She also mentioned she had to quit a dull job, didn't she? I mean, you're set for life, dude. Just be the... F parents set you up. Yeah, I understand following your passion, though, so keep it real. Uh, now I see. Keeping it a family affair. Ding, ding. Documents that you have already reviewed may be updated from time to time as events unfold. The reader will notify you when that happens. The National Beholder just published a new article. You may want to look at it and see if there's any new information available. Okay. Prime rates drop. Is that the one? Safety bill. Just looking for highlighted stuff. I wonder if I'm actually going to have to read all this. If it's going to stop holding my hand with those highlights. Catherine Delacroix. Arthur Scott Gallagher, Robert Blaine. Where are you going to punch, brother? Put your fist. Peter Faulkner. Oh, wait. Do I have to figure out one of these if they're a lawyer? Prime Minister. Economic trade. Commander in chief of the nation's forces. Read 
rebuilding schools. This would take years if I actually read all of this out loud. Not gonna lie. Negotiations failed. I think I read that already. So does the star mean there's something there for me to uncover still? I would assume that is CS company. We are urgently looking for a chief operating officer to replace the tired, formerly appointed predecessor. She retired. Maybe I was wrong and nothing stays in the family. Ouch. This is probably what she meant about quitting her job. Okay, so we're learning. You go to all the bookmarks. There's something there to find. You just gotta find it. Hey, there's the lawyer. Orwell informs me you just encountered conflicted data chunks. Whenever the content of two data chunks are at odds with one another, those will be shown as conflicted. When you extract one of the data chunks containing a conflict, the others will become invalid immediately. I highly recommend that you clarify the context of the conflict before you proceed. Through this is your, though this is your decision. Once the information has been parsed, there is no way to reverse your choice. Okay. case being closed due to lack of evidence the wealthy family of the accused might have influenced the outcome in her favor that sounds like hearsay but investigation into malicious and in the malicious injury of police officer has been dropped here the trial the suspect's lawyer Joseph Langley. Okay, we need to make, make a new profile for that guy, I'm pretty sure. Joseph Langley. Guess we're not there yet. Back here, and then go to her. Criminal case closed due to lack of evidence. Disable. There's a conflict with another data chunk. Procedure closing raises manipulation suspicions. So these two conflict each other. Is that what it's saying? That is what I figured. A pity that the CCTV feed did not actually help. Maybe it will today. Currently, I'm thinking that our Miss Watergate underwent quite a radical change. Don't you agree? Let's find out what happens in between those two lives of hers. What may have caused a radical shift? She dyed her hair blue. It's not that radical. <clears throat> <clears throat> Where were we? I'm trying to find out what was going on that made such a radical change in her personality. Blue hair. She was she she go into the peacekeeping missions or That just takes me right back, I think. Yeah. Okay, so. Safety bill.
Donate, volunteer, become a member. Positions. Safety and security. I feel like I should go back to her oh, timeline. That just popped up out of nowhere, I swear. You're invited to tea inside the rabbit hole. Oh, is she lying about her birthday? Hang on. Let's check this. Oh, I know. Maybe I just didn't have it. All right, let's put that up there. Interest, art, music, activism. Oh, she's an activist. We already know that, but it's confirmed. What a lineup. She likes her cat, Kiko. Alice in Wonderland. I kind of gathered that already. The Targets painting. What's the Targets? Is that a band? First day in freedom. Far away from the shackles of Watergate Pharma. What? Who's going to pay for your stuff now? Mommy and Daddy won't like this. Listen, Jake. I'm not Daddy's little girl anymore. My heart has already got me a lot of money. More than enough to pay all, all my bills. Don't you worry. Wow, she sounds like a piece of work. But I understand, man. Follow your passion. Despised puppets of the state, you have finally managed to destroy us entirely. There's nothing less left to do but to congratulate you. These are my personal wishes to you from the deepest abyss of my heart. Wow. I don't even want to repeat that. That's going to that's going to put me on a list somewhere if I were to say those words. All right. Well, well, Miss Watergate, we aren't too fond of you either. All right, confirmed. The gov. Mary oblige. Sweetie, what's the matter? That totally doesn't sound like you. We haven't hugged, hung out in ages. You got to get out from time to time. You'd feel much better. Oh, Jesus. What a response. <laughs> like, she's just asking if you're okay, man, and do you want to hang out? I'm not in the mood. Just slap that on over. I don't even care, man. I'm just throwing everything over there. Sad. What, me or her? Because I'm just throwing everything. Cassandra is in a relationship with Joseph Langley, not a member. Bam. With her lawyer? Hmm. Might be noteworthy. Beholder actually wrote about me being freaking redeemed. A bit. But surprise, surprise, they had to mention the speculations over my parents buying me out. Makes the click counts go boom, doesn't it? Wait, what is this? The 20... August 10th, 2016. Uh, okay, so it's a couple couple months later. Jeez, what a, what a drastic change. From like, oh, hey, we're friends. Want to go out to... Look at this guy. Isn't that, isn't that Sora from Kingdom Hearts? Harrison O'Donnell. What a tool. <laughs> wow, I'm so happy for you. Concert was amazing. Uh... You gave your hair the makeup makeover after the concert, okay? Oh, we got blues. Catharsis. So she might use that alias somewhere. We should look up an alias name. You know, people on the web, so many names, so many identities. It's always good to record every alias. 
then we can match data chunks to targeted persons wherever they're using them. Invite to your little activist group. Activist group. Is there anything more specific? I don't know. I want to keep reading. It's like I'm using Facebook, but I have no clue who these people are. Okay, reader. What you got for me? Headlines? That listener. Ah, uh, it's a listener. No, it wasn't. Unless it, oh, okay, there's a new one. There's a new one. What you got, Joseph? Hey, did you hear about the Freedom Plaza bombing? Yeah, don't remind me. You know I have a history with that place. Ari messes with me that I have to catch a bus from there every day. Too many bad memories, and now I was just there moments before this happened. I should never have gone to that protest. Darling, you don't need to justify yourself to anybody, especially not me. I was so happy when Godfells accepted me into it, though. Interesting, maybe the influencer, and who is this Godfells? We should find something that shows our current atti attitude and see if we're following the right person. And we should probably just update that she goes there every day, so it might have just been a coincidence. Meaning her presence there before the bombing could be coincidence after all. I'll reserve my thoughts until you find more evidence. So do I get to call at the end? If, uh, like, do I get to be the judge and jury? She's guilty. Uh, missed a whole conversation there. Think of it this way. If you would have not gone to the protest, then you you never would have been wrongfully ind indicted. And we would have never met. Yeah, and I would have not been called a terrorist in all the papers. You are not a terrorist, okay? Oh, I don't even want to say that word. Ain't I? You sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. No, oh, darn it. What? Your car's not working. Here, you can't buy anything. Have you gone ban bankrupt or something? Uh-oh, she might be breaking up with him. Yeah, he ran out of money. Unless you went on a serious shopping spree, there should be plenty of money on there. I guess we'll have to go without wine then. Uh, Here's the thing. I've got an important appointment tonight. It's surprisingly out of schedule, and I can't postpone it. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, they might actually be breaking up. I'm very sorry, darling. We'll see each other tomorrow. You always have an appointment. Exclamation point one. She's she's upset. She's starting to mess up. Appointment here, appointment there, appointment everywhere. How can you c constantly do this to me? Darling, calm down. Have you taken your methrin? Uh. What's methrin? Could you look that up for me, please? Dude, I'm the one already scrolling through stuff. I'm reading their chat like some creep. Trying to figure out if she did it or if she didn't do it. But he's still talking. I didn't hear a beep. Is that the only thing that matters to you? That I am on my happy pills all day? Darling, please, it's nothing like that, and you know it. So I keep my mouth shut whenever you leave me hanging. If I don't show up to this appointment, I risk losing a very important client. Fine. Oof. That response. Don't you understand that? Oh, no, I totally understand. Don't you risk losing that very important client of yours now? Cassie, don't be like that. I get it. I guess I'm not an important client anymore. Oh, come on, Cassie. Going home now, in case I'm getting up on that priority list of yours anytime soon. In case I'm getting up on... Okay, please. Session closed. All right. <clears throat> 
One man watches the safe. Two man team gets power. Oh yeah, that'd be pretty cool actually. Like uh, one turn, like a you separate, turn the power on to get out while the other people loot or like keep in mind where the loot is. <clears throat> Trying to make your Reddit content again. Catharsis Kappa. Hit me up when you're playing a real man's game, Darth. Alright, Buzz, I'm sorry I missed you if you already left. He's a government man now. Kappa. Who, me? Darling. <laughs> this government guy, guys, guy is trying to get... Oh, he's trying to bully you? Okay. Bully. Okay, we are going to products and going to see if I'm using my own supply. Oh, it's right there. Methrin Blue. Blue, you will find a small selection of our most popular products. Cough drops. Activating pills. Medication that increases concentration and cerebral performance. Focus in. It, it it's it's funny because that sounds like <laughs> a real pill though <sighs> hey are you focusing over there yeah man super focusing uh, what made me cry a little bit okay methrin is an antidepressant right, throw that over there i wonder if she i wonder if her adverse attitude towards the assault is actually worth anything Perhaps emotions were high if she's relying on this medication. Look at what you've extracted so far. We're dealing with a potentially dangerous personality. I will indicate that to law enforcement. I mean, if you're taking an antidepressant and you're depressed, you're probably not dangerous. You're probably just going to eat food and sit in your bed all day. Nope. Mm -hmm. But everybody's different. Uh, where am I going? Assess Cassandra's attitude towards the assault or violence in general. Okay. We need to see if she's a violent individual. I mean, if she hit an officer in the head with a brick. But she did get acquitted for that, you know? She didn't. Didn't get charged, so innocent until proven guilty. The thought overview. The thoughts are free. If liberty means anything at all, it means the right to tell people what they do not want to hear. George Orwell. Oh, okay, we actually got an Orwell reference in the Orwell game. Nice. Hmm. Freedom is unfree. Sure, let's start with entry nine. Oh, I got a ding. That mean a chat, right? Chat's going on. No, just a new bookmark. Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, published by Catharsis. Can't tell it's her because her hair's not blue. Count Catharsis, contact Cassie 92, April 2017. It's cams, cams everywhere, even at the Freedom Plaza. Is it just me or is it a little bit more, I don't know, ironic? We were there because we wanted a peaceful protest. We have always been against violence. Could just be her saying that though. Uh, okay, so I shouldn't have actually put that up. Maybe. All right. What we found so far is good and interesting, but I think we should be searching for something a little bit more concrete. I have to dig deeper, deeper, deeper. Listener. Okay. New chat. I want to. It's Juliet Carrington. I don't even want to pronounce the J. Hey, Cassie. Hi, Yules. I'm sticking with the no J thing. Cassie, I wanted you to know. 
your post on timelines about this assault. Really, Jules, you're not gonna. Oh wait, <laughs> I messed up. Really, Jules, you're not gonna preach to me about this stupid post, are you? You really shouldn't write something like that. No, I just want to know what's wrong, Cassie. It's nothing. Just between the two of us. I just had to let off some steam, you know? Because of what happened, isn't it? Yeah, and lots of other stuff today. This bombing stirred up all that crap again. You know, what I did. What happened there wasn't your fault. Meh. Dot, dot, dot. Wait, are they just dotting or are they typing? Okay. The music just drastically changed. That threw me off for a second. Cassie, you hurt that officer to save me and succeeded. You must have forgot about that. That was so brave. How can it not have been a f my fault? I smashed the... F oh, the confessions. There's confessions. We can arrest her. We probably won't be able to hold her for long if it really happened in defense of this Juliet. Very good work. The intervention team is already on its way. We'll need to wait for confirmation. Next stop, Wonderland, right? Just kidding. Next time, be careful with providing the wrong data, okay? In Miss Watergate's case, it's it was not the problem to get her address with the help of a local police due to her former record. Who knows what would have what would have happened if you hadn't stopped him. And that's why you should really remove this post. I feel like an a-hole, the worst kind of a-hole. I might be free, but not rightly so. I'm not innocent. Oh, Cassie, nobody is innocent. You'll have to let go. Session closed. Oh, wait, another session. I thought about what you said. Maybe you're right. Should take the post down. It'd be better, believe me. Wait a second. Somebody's at the door. BRB. She's not coming back, boys. Okay, I'll wait. You're gonna be waiting a while. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. She's talking. So I'm talking. By the way, how's your boyfriend? You still together? You haven't talked about him much lately. Well, not as much as before. Dot, dot, dot. Hello? Told you, she's not coming back. Are you still there? Cassie? Oh. I'll inquire if all went well with arresting Miss Watergate. You did a good job in any case. Although we have no proof she is involved in the bombing, we might be able to question her. Despite acting in defense of this Jul Juliet, she seems to be quite unstable and a threat. Okay, I just received confirmation that she is now in custody. Very good work indeed. I'm curious though about this thought group. Whether they... Oh god. Oh god. Two dead after second explosion? So it's not Cassie unless she's a mastermind. Uh... No, no, no. Take a look at the news. Alright. I'm, I'm going. It's the worst one. National Beholder headlines. Explosive charge. Oh, that is horrible. I, I was reading there, bruh. If you like games like this, you would say you would like her story. It involves figuring things out by interview video, though. Cassie dead? Oh, yeah, they just arrested her. Um, well, I mean, maybe. Maybe she was part of the, the bombing that just happened. Although she's not a student, so... You can strike that off the list. Um, it's interesting. Uh, at first I was a little meh of it, but I'm, I'm getting into it a little bit more as I'm playing and, like, reading. And I, I feel like a cyber sleuth. Cyber sloth. Wait, hang on. I feel like a cyber sleuth. A cyber sloth. 
Yeah, my wife got that for me. <sighs> she says I am the embodiment of a sloth. She's not wrong. Alright. Like text. That is horrible. Two dead. Similar approach. Same letter found. So these assaults are connected. Wait, there was a letter on the first one? I didn't I didn't remember that anyways. And if that wasn't enough already, Miss Watergate was in custody at the time. So that's her out of the picture, at least for this attack. Ugh. This complicates matters massively. So much for our simple test case. I need to speak to my superiors, see how we are to proceed, given these extenuating circumstances. You did good today. You can log off and get some rest by clicking the button at the top right of the desktop, trying to get some, some sleep. I have a feeling the next few days are going to be trying at best. All right, so we're going to log out. Um, and how far along are we? Okay. I'm going to call it on um, Orwell. I, I briefly forgot the name of the game. Um, I do want to play this more and more as I'm playing. Uh, it is getting a little bit more interesting and like you, you have the power, right? But so far I've just been slapping everything I see over into the profile. So I need to be a little bit more selective, I think. Uh, and which might add to like replayability, right? Like what if I didn't find certain evidence and she didn't get arrested? Like what would happen then? So that like, it's like an interactive story, which is pretty cool. If you like reading, if you like being a, a cyber sleuth, cyber sleuth, if you like being that, um, I think I would recommend this, but only for a certain niche of people, uh, not everybody's going to enjoy it. And I didn't at first until I started playing a little bit more. And, but now I, I, I'm getting into it. And if you want to see more, let me know down in the comments below for those of you watching on YouTube. Thank you and have a good day. Thanks for hanging out. Go.